Hey, it's July 29th, 2019. This is Andrew in Omaha, Nebraska. And I'm going to do a little experiment. I want to find out if oil tan leather can be stamped or not. And I'm always told that leather that's oil tanned or chrome tanned uh, will not take a stamp as opposed to vegetable tan leather, uh, which will take a stamp. So I'm going to use this piece of Crazy Horse uh, oil tan leather from the Springfield Leather Company. I think this is four to five ounce. And I'm going to use my Arbor Press to try and press my maker's mark into it. I'm not going to heat this up or anything. I'm just gonna press it in there cold and we'll see what happens. So this is my Harbor Freight Arbor Press. And I just have this little place, uh, piece of plastic here to help have a nice foundation for doing stamps. And We'll just put the maker's mark on here and we'll see what happens. Sorry I had to move the camera because it's going to get hit by the handle. And there you go. It looks like it did take the stamp without being adding heat or anything else. Let's try some other stamps. I got a little package here of just a couple Tandy stamps. We use the same strip of leather. Let's start with a letter. This is the letter A. That's stamped in nice. Let's try an American flag. That came out nice. Let's see here. Got a little peace symbol. Let's try one more. Let's try this horse. And there you go. Now let's try doing a stamp by uh, using the hammer. What I have is the same letter A that comes in the Tandy Leather uh, Alphabet Kit. This is a one inch uh, letter. And then here's the little uh, adapter that goes on the back so you can strike it with a hammer. And then I'm just gonna use this two pound dead blow hammer. And that one turned out just fine as well. Now let's try one last uh, stamp. This is a wallet I made out of a different type of oil tan leather. It came from the Springfield Leather Company, but I don't remember what uh, the title was to this uh, piece or to this hide. But we'll see if it will uh, leave an imprint on here the same as the uh, Crazy Horse oil tan leather. And it did. So in conclusion, it looks like the answer is yes, you can uh, put stamps into oil tan leather. I know when you see the ads on different websites that sell leather that uh, these uh, oil tan will not take a stamp. So 
As far as these two different hides are concerned, they did take the stamp using both the Arbor Press and uh, with the mallet. Your results may be different with a different hide. I don't know, but I think it makes the piece look nice. And here's a wallet that I made from, this is the Maker Leather Supply Kit, or pattern rather. And I was able to put my Maker's Mark in there, and it looks really nice. Makes it look nice and finished. So can oil tan leather take a stamp? I would say yes. This is Andrew in Omaha, Nebraska. Have a nice day.